Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Among the Stars Celebrity Perfume Reviews. So, today I'm going to be doing my May perfume talk. I figured that I actually wanted to do this perfume talk for quite a while since I got this new perfume room, but I had to wait until May just because I wanted to keep with tradition and keep it kind of going the way it was. Sorry, yawning. Anyway, so, new perfumes coming out relatively soon not newest one that's probably coming out this next is um cody's love to love bluebell and white tea um i know a while back i did a review on all four of the love to love perfumes that were out already that are exclusive to walmart here in the united states they are um some very inexpensive floral perfumes that go to walmart they're about 10 bucks a piece um i will be getting the the Blue Belt and White Tea just to get it and continue that collection. If you guys would like a review on that, I will definitely do that. Um, I have been um, tallying all your guys' reviews up and whatnot. There's some reviews that you guys have asked me to do that I can't really... I'm going to try my best to review, but I don't know if I can, only because they... I can't get notes for them or whatnot, um, but I'm going to do my best to get those. Um, another fragrance I'm not sure when exactly is coming out officially. I've heard rumors. Um, Ariana Grande is releasing her first debut fragrance. I've heard rumors that it'll be getting launched September 27th at Macy's in New York. But we will see how well that all goes. You guys always know that somehow there's a way to get it earlier. Um, not sure on the name, not sure on the notes yet. Based on Ariana and some of the things that she wears, I feel like it's going to be... Um, a fruity floral scent, but I feel like it's going to be a little slightly different from a lot of the other fruity florals that we have out. We'll see what happens from there. Another one that I'm super, super excited about, and if you guys would have saw my Twitter the other day, I posted a very long 140 character OMG tweet that was just literally OMG, OMG, OMG. Something I'm very, very excited about. I can't tell you guys what it is yet. I wish I could, but there will be a new perfume coming out. I want to say between July and September, I'm not 100% on that release date yet, but it is a new perfume that I'm very, very, very excited about, something I'm extremely looking forward to, so we'll kind of see how that one goes. Some other fun stuff. I've done some more rearranging since I've been in here, not like bookcases, but I kind of changed the Marc Jacobs over here and made it a little more full back here. Been doing some slight... Um, adding to this room and whatnot, I added some lights to my Nicki Minaj shelf, which you guys, or my Nicki Minaj Minaj the Exotics that you guys saw. Also added some lights to my Taylor Swift boxes. I wasn't sure if that was on my, um, room tour or not. I actually, just before I started filming, I just put up a light outside this room that I put like a light fixture up there and it's got like a red light bulb in it. So that way when I'm recording in here hopefully if everything goes right people won't knock on the doors and whatnot to come in here and interrupt videos which i mean shouldn't be a huge deal but we'll see you know anyway other fun things that have happened uh something i didn't talk about in my perfume room tour thing whatever you want to call it is how semi-complicated it was to do this room um i have slight OCD when it comes to this room and I'm very nitpicky about a lot of the things that happened in here. Um, I had measured everything out precisely to the T and knew what was going to go where and how it was going to go and had to do a lot of like minor construction work. Oh my god. I cannot stop yawning. Anyway. Um, but I had everything kind of precise to the T on how, what, how and what everything was going to go where and the one thing I did not think to measure, and I feel stupid for doing it, was my big, huge, gray bookshelf that my Nicki Minaj, my Britney Spears, and my Justin Bieber's are on that sits right behind the camera. I didn't think to measure if it would go up the stairs, because like I told you guys, my old perfume room was downstairs, new one's upstairs. And I didn't think to see if it would go up the flight of stairs. And 
this bookcase, my husband built me this bookcase. Built, painted it, built the back, everything. And he built this thing solid. This thing is never going to come apart. Like, okay, it could come apart, but it's not going to go back together after you take it apart. So, we had to get creative on how we were going to get this stupid thing upstairs. Not that the bookcase is stupid, but at the time it was stupid. So we had to get creative, and my husband came up with this idea to take the window out, because on our staircase there's like a bay window, and the center window you can take like, the window actually goes up and down, like the two sides are just like windows that you can look out but you can't open them. The middle one you can actually open, and if you do it right you can take out both panes of the glass, so it's just a big open hole in the wall, and he came up with this idea to for him and I to carry it, the bookcase outside, put it underneath the window, tie a like a tow strap that you would use for your car to tow something and like tie it down, tie it around this bookcase. Our neighbor came over and we lifted the bookcase up and into the window and pulled it through the window to get it up here because it was not going to come up the bookcase like our stairs. Because our stairs go like they're almost like an S, like they're weird. There's no like. It's hard to get anything up those stairs, let alone a four and a half or like a five foot bookcase that's sturdy as hell and not gonna move. So, you know. But that was definitely probably the funnest part of doing this room. Some things that come, I like I told you guys, um, I'm gonna be getting some LED lights to hang up in the lanterns that hang up, which I don't even think you guys can see. No, you guys can't. But anyway, I'm gonna put some LED lights in my lanterns so that those kind of glow and change colors. Also, an idea that I kind of, I thought of this idea a long time ago when I still had the old perfume room and the constant ever wanting of more posters. And then I kind of scrapped the idea because I couldn't get it to work the way I wanted to. And then my friend Finn came up with an idea without even knowing I had an idea similar to it. And I'm actually going to take his idea and run with it because it was a really good idea. And I'm going to be mounting, when you guys saw the... Uh, room tour over here. I have a uh, Lady Gaga fan poster. I'm not sure where that's going to go after I move it, but that's going to come down and I'm going to mount a TV to the wall right there. And I'm going to have perfume commercials like looping on it all the time. Like, not all the time. Like, this perfume commercials are going to be on it and displayed and one next thing is kind of... It was a really cool idea that it's just kind of add this kind of touch to this room to give it that kind of extra whatnot, whatever you want to call it. Because I love the promotional stuff that they do for perfumes. I feel like um, they spend so much money on the promotional advertisements and whatnot for fragrances. I wish that sometimes they would get more um, praise in, than what they do. So I'm going to collect a lot of those uh, perfume commercials and whatnot. And just kind of have them looping there all the time. So, I can't really think of anything else. Um, I will be doing a lot more reviews for you guys. I'm not sure exactly when. Kind of hectic with work and whatnot. But, I will be doing more reviews for you guys. I do have, like what you guys asked for me to do. I have a, like a list of things you guys have asked me to do. <sighs> I just need to take a nap. Anyway, um, I have a whole list. And if you guys want something, like always, just comment down below and I will add it to my list and just pick something one day and review it. So, as always, guys, thanks so, so much for watching. Can't wait to see what comes this month in May. And I like, also, I like always, guys, if you guys watch my Instagram and my Twitter, I always update you guys on the new stuff when I get bottle designs and so on and so forth. So, follow me on Twitter, A the S Perfume, and Instagram, Among the Stars Perfume. And as always, guys, thanks so, so much for watching. Bye.